As a part of their initial training, the cadets went through day one of the Field Leaders Reaction Course, also known as FLRC, on June 6, 2016. Right now we have the cadets um, on the course. They are going through the obstacles. Their objective is to uh, work together as a team and be able to um, form uh, that bond, not just on their individual leadership abil abilities, but their uh, team building skills. Right now the cadets are doing a, um, a similar to a leader's reaction course in which they are confronted with a complex problem and have to use their adaptability and improvisation skills to, uh, to overcome a problem. Starting with the barrel roll, the first squad, which was part of the Alpha Company, got a taste of what it's like to rely on your team and solve a solution with a time restraint. Well, I knew that it was probably going to be something confusing without a clear solution. And I knew that uh, we'd probably have to try a few things before we found the right way to do it. Instead of thinking, yay, I got across, you should be th you should uh, be focused on how you get the rest of your team across as well. After the time was up for each course, the squad would receive what is called hot wash. During this time, the cadets reflect on the obstacle, the struggles they faced, and most importantly, figure out how they can strengthen the communication amongst each other. It wasn't until yesterday where I really started to get to show my team, because that's when we started doing all the team building exercises, our, all our confidence building. Um, I actually see a lot of strong leaders in our team now. I think it's really good to see how everyone kind of comes together because everyone brings their own things to the table. Uh, a lot of us come from different walks of life and we all have different personal experiences within our time on ROTC. So it's really cool to see everyone's different leadership styles coming in play and a lot of us we go off of each other. And it's really helpful to uh, get more into it because a lot of us are very dogmatic. We're all really set in our ways. It's going to get us shaken up every once in a while. Reporting for Fort Knox, Kentucky for the Public Affairs Office, my name is Altaf Narabadi.